So previously mods couldn't bet, now they are allowed to bet. It just if they bet they can't tamper with the results, which is good. Like that's that's only fair. It's an it's a reasonable compromise, so really no no issue with that over here. Alright, chat, here it is, game three, Dallas, Cloud Lovin. Who's gonna take the set? Shadow is 0-3 today, by the way. But Boltu is 0-1. One. one of these decks has to win. Which one is it gonna be? Which player will rise up and start Swiss with a W? Your boy Dallas. Okay, this looks like some Boltu early game. On the other hand, we saw Armor Goblin. That guy can tank an entire world. <laughs> That's not bad early game for Cloud Lovin. A 2 drop and a 3 drop? Oh shit, he got, he, that's the nuts chat. This man top decked the Bone Fanatic. Is that not a sign of victory for Shadowcraft? Ooh, okay, wait a second, wait a second. Well, Dallas top decked the Boltio, so... He just has to hold on, right? Force Resurrection? Ah... Uh, what do I feel like that's way worse than Armored Goblin? That's basically summoning a 1 1 for 2 play points. Which I dare say is significantly worse than summoning a Goblin for 2 play points. I don't think that's worth it. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna be honest, that's not worth it. <laughs> oh shit, he got a Ramiel. Damn. That's a tough decision. Do you play the Ramiel or do you hold it? Oh, he's holding it. I, I like it. Let's go, Dallas. He wanted the future value of the armor? I mean, I guess so. It does let him hold the armor go goblin, so that may be what he was looking into. And I guess I, I can respect that. Okay, so it should be Axel. Wait, what does this guy do? I don't actually know. If you have 20 or less, game plus 1 plus 1 and he was for 0. Oh shit. That's insane. On Evo, he gets plus 2 plus 2 on ward? Crazy. Wait, that guy's mad good. So, I'm looking at Ramiel into Boltio, right? For the Swift GG. We'll see, though. Can Shadow have enough aggression to take up the early... Take up Boltio before he goes too crazy? Yeah, actual Boltio support is cool. I'm a fan. There's no EO, but... I mean, Ramiel's pretty good. Maybe he draws another 2-drop. Not quite. Do not seek what is not there, chat. Okay, Dallas fighting back. Shouldn't he take out the Keeper to deny that potential evil value? I feel like you gotta take out the Keeper, right? Retracing the past. Well, there's another uh, Goblin potential. Ceres is online. Going for the Ceres. Okay, this is actually really close, chat. Like, Cloud Love is off to a good start, and he's making boards, he's man going face. But Dallas has the bolt too, and he's ramping into it. This is really gonna be a, a close battle, I feel like. Yeah, he's definitely going for the Bahamut, right? Dallas definitely setting up the Bahamut, and he's done a good job of it too. Like, if he gets to go into Boltio, with 10 life to his name, would that be good enough, chat? Can we say that is good enough? Is he gonna trade? Oh, I don't know if I like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. He's just giving Dallas more life to work with. Yeah, I, I don't know if I like that. Bahamut clears, Bolti will clear. Then after that, it's just nothing but a, a shower of buffed up wards. Playing around Vengeance? Yeah, I, I don't I don't approve of the traits. Is this the armor goblin power play? No uh, it's not that good, right? <laughs> See, like now? I don't know, man. I don't know if Cloud Lovin has what it takes to close the game out now. I, I don't know if he's gonna have enough. 
I guess a couple soul strikes. Maybe we'll get there. Maybe? That's a weak Shadowverse board. And the Boltio. Oh, the Boltio's gonna be there, chat. It's an instant slam. Board is gone. What does Dallas get out of Boltio? Wait, he's not the 10 life. Uh, wait, doesn't this heal him? At the start of your opponent's turn, if you have Vengeance, restore 4? Oh, shit. Wow, he just RNG'd 4 life out of his ass. And that could actually be the difference. Where's the Shadow Board? Shadow Burst? Wow, that heal is massive. Wait, Chris, Chris. Wait, hold on a second, chat. Hold on a second. Chris is online. Chris is crazy, right? Chris is actually insane. Is he? Okay, get the Chris online. Yes. Get that Chris online. Okay, who, who wins, chat? Bolty or Chris? Oh, shit. He drew Basaraga. Okay, wait, wait a second, chat. Wait a second. Wait a second. This man actually drew Basaraga. I think we may just have a real Shadowers battle in our hands. Both players have evil points, they got resources. You're wide open. This could still go either way. I, I don't know, there man. No this could still go either way. You smell like YouTuber? <laughs> okay. Oh, another Boltio? That's not bad. It's honestly not bad. Is he gonna cash it in? I do fear for Basraga. Like, does Basraga win against Boltio? Ooh, I like this play! Pre Evo? So he can cash out the face damage, right? It means that he's gonna get one follower less. But he does get seven face damage out of this. And that's a lot of damage. <laughs> A mana grocer? I mean, it's a 5-7, I guess. Can't complain, right? Could be worse. <laughs> I mean, like, okay, Basraga's insane, but, like, Basraga's one dude. And that's his whole turn, right? Like, to play Basraga is to die, right? Yeah, he can't play the Basraga. Wait, wait a second, chat. Okay, I see it. Cloud Lovin is a genius. He's going to spam... The Kageros until Soul Strike can OTK. Five Soul Strikes can do 20 damage, you know? Wait, is this good enough though? He put him back in Vengeance. Wait a second, chat. Wait a second. Dallas is back in Vengeance. What does he what does he do? Grimmer is not even close to being online. This guy has Storm, right? <laughs> Please, Archdemon, <laughs> I pray to thee. Okay, Dark Summons. Wait, that's a start. <laughs> this is such a close game. This is probably the closest game we've had the entire day. Okay, can give that dude Rush. Wait, he could just... Maybe just keep going face, right? He still has Evo, by the way. Like, Dallas has plays. He actually has plays for days. The Soul Strike is kind of scary, not gonna lie. Like, low key, the Soul Strikes are kind of scaring me, but. I mean. You know. He's trading. What does he get? A Lucifer? Ooh, Lucifer's a spicy one. Lucifer with an evil that he still has. Lucifer could just win the game by himself. Okay, what is the Cloud Loman response? What can he even do, chat? Okay, double Basaraga? He could do it. One Basaraga, two Basaragas. Lovers? Oh, yeah, he can Lovers him. Wait, he can Lovers. Lovers just clears the board. He's doing it, he's going for it. Okay, put Dallas down to 6 life. Double Soul Strike sets up for lethal next turn. Unless... Dallas heals, which he can. Thunderbolt is a heal. Would get him just out of range of dying to double Soul Strike. 
This is so close. This is such a close game. Oh, he drew an Alucard. Insane. I don't know what he needs. He needs some good shit out of Bolty, though. Like, he needs something real hype. I was gonna trade. Keep the 5-7 alive and let the Bolty do his thing. Arc Demon, Boom Devil. Those are somewhat thick. Okay. Two soul strikes. He's so close to lethal. He's actually so close to lethal. Like, is this double Buster Aga time? Can he pull another Kagero out of somewhere to get a third soul strike for lethal? Wait, Friends Forever summons Kagero, right? No, it didn't summon it. It did not summon the two drop legendary. Dude, I respect him going for that. It didn't summon it though. Yeah, I'm sweating too, chat. I don't even know who I want to win, but I'm, I'm sweating. We are sweating out here. The Friends Forever might be keeping him alive. It actually is going to do quite a bit of work. Okay. I don't know what to, I don't know what's going on, chat. I don't know what to believe on anymore. Ooh, the oh, I, I don't think he's attacking the world. I don't think he's gonna attack with that. Oh shit, Gabriel! But there's friends forever and Chris effect. Ooh, Gabriel would have been nice. This is such a weird game. This is actually such a weird game, but a really hype game at that. I I don't know I don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know what to say, chat. This shit's just crazy. <laughs> the soul strike is gonna be, or would be, how Cloud Lovin wins this game. As for Dallas, I don't know, man. He's not in wrath, not even remotely close. Doesn't Dallas win? I'm not seeing lethal. Wait, does he have lethal? Remember, he has friends forever. I mean, fleeting joy. He can only take five at a time. So is this five, ten? Four, two. Wait, that is lethal. Yeah, it is lethal. Wait, Dallas has lethal. Okay, Dallas has lethal. He just has to see it. Does he see the lethal? The world actually gives him the perfect lethal. Dallas, time's running out. Rush guy. The world. No, he missed it. Oh, Dallas missed lethal. Oh, Chad, he missed lethal. He can't attack with the world. Oh, man, he missed the lethal. Okay, can Cloud Love and capitalize? Can he capitalize? Dallas did not see it. It was a complicated one. We figured it out. It was tough though. You just have to clear the weapon and go face with everything. It was exact, like exact lethal. Lovin has lethal. Well, he definitely has lethal now, right? He definitely has lethal now. Soul Strike, Soul Strike, Necro Impulse. I walk away to the yeah, wait, how did he get the extra one life? That means that he didn't have lethal. It's because of the, uh, the one heal actually put him out of range. Meaning that Dallas didn't actually have lethal. Then his play was probably correct, right? But Cloud Lovin will have lethal this turn. And after a very intense set, I lost. Cloud Lovin is gonna take the set. Shadow will finally pick up a victory. It still would have been lethal, really? How does he get the extra one damage then? Yo, that was a good Shadowverse set though. A clappy clap to both players Dallas, Cloud Lovin.
But it's Cloud Lovin who is victorious. That was a good set of Shadowverse channel.